Sometimes a play unfolds in front of you perfectly. Here's what I mean. So in this video, we're currently on a buy I've round. We're going to go ahead and execute short A. Raze throws her utility here, so I'm going to back up just a little bit. You're going to notice in this round that I'm a little bit stiff because I'm using firing air instead of binding crouch to my fire. So I'm getting used to the aim. I think in the long run, it'll help me. So I do see that Raze needs help, so I'm going to go ahead and heal her. Sky gets her from long, so I'm going to go ahead and walk. See if I can Last get this res. Standing. Yikes, both of my guys die in A. Thankfully, Sky doesn't walk, so it's a free res. It's a 2v2. I'm going to slow off the entrance so they can't rush in and get me while I plant. I'm going to go ahead and plant at the default location. And you know what's going to happen next. We're going to wall off the spike. So since Raze is in hookah, I'm going to go ahead and run into elbow. I'm going to reload here. Raze gets the enemy raise. It's a 2v1. We're in excellent shape. So as I walk into elbow, Yuru ults. But what happens next? We see his orb. This is so perfect. This is so perfect. So in this situation, do you A, knife the Yuru, or do you B, shoot the Yuru? If you answered A, you answered correctly. In this situation, you knife the Yuru. Thank you for watching, and I hope that this can help you win some rounds.